The Colts have problems, major, major problems. And the reason we're talking about them today is because Tony Dungy was caught on camera when he thought he was off the air on the Dan Patrick Show saying that Jim Irsay told people last month that the owner believes Andrew Luck's injury is in his head. Now, I think there's some context here. I think everybody knows that Andrew Luck's shoulder is a mess. He had surgery. It occurred, the injury, back in 2015, week three against the Tennessee Titans. It's real, it happens, but it's been mismanaged and bungled at every single level. Thus, I think for Andrew Luck, the head is connected to the shoulder. And I get it. Andrew Luck is spooked. He should be. He should have been placed on the pup list to start the season, not messing around with practice. And we first guessed that here on Time to Shine. The Colts needed to protect their investments. Ursay should have never said this summer that Andrew Luck was actually going to play in week one. It was never an option. Ursay deserves blame. Former general manager Ryan Grigson could be sued for malpractice. He was so bad and never gave Luck an offensive line and what he needed around him. Chuck Pagano deserves blame. The head coach for how he's handled all this. And new general manager Chris Ballard, wow, he's in the wrong too. And Ballard and Pagano have been all over the map when they start talking about the end game where the path and the road should have been crystal clear for this season for Andrew Luck. Protect your franchise quarterback and your investments. I spoke to a long time and tapped in Indianapolis columnist Bob Kravitz on my Sirius XM radio show today. Ursa doesn't want Luck out of Indy, and Andrew Luck hasn't asked to be traded. Andrew Luck wants to be healthy. It's a total mess. And this is why for years we called for Grigson to be fired. He was terrible. But Jim Ursay, how do you keep Chuck Pagano and go halfway cleaning up the mess? Kravitz says Ursay would love the wish list to, for the next head coach to start with big names like Nick Saban and Jim Harbaugh and John Gruden, and it should. The Colts are a mess. But in theory, if Andrew Luck is healthy, this is a fantastic job. If he's not, it's the Browns and a disaster.